Wheels and uh, welcome to our custom Brompton folding bike configurator. This is the easiest and fastest way to go through and build your own custom Brompton folding bike step by step. So the next option we got to take a look at is uh, lighting. So your basic configuration with a Brompton is uh, just reflectors. So you have a front reflector and a rear reflector. Obviously uh, you can only be seen if someone's shining a light on you. So. Uh, this is more of a daytime kind of bike, unless you have other lights. Uh, then let's take a look at the lighting set. Uh, here we have a front light, and uh, that has a flashing and a steady beam. Then you have a solid rear light, just like that. And uh, you can see there, on and off, this one's just solid. You've got two selections of Dynamo bikes. The first one is a efficient Shimano hub dynamo. So there's your dynamo in the front wheel, and you've got a uh, halogen light in the front and an LED tail light. So in this one, all you have to do is go, and it produces light for you, so that's great. You never have to buy batteries. Uh, we'll go into more detail about both dynamo bikes in their detail videos. Uh, in the meantime, let's move right on to the San hub dynamo. This is uh, definitely the most deluxe lighting kit. Um, it's got a beautiful, very efficient uh, dynamo there in the front wheel. It's got a high power LED front headlight and uh, a tail light on this one because it's an R bike is actually in the back there. So let's take a look at the reflectors. You can see it's got reflectors. They've kind of been around forever. The design doesn't change much, but uh, they're nice and bright if uh, you got a car light shining on you. So this is a good option uh, if you already have lights, if you know you never ride at night, uh, or if you have something super fancy that you want to put on. Again, you see here the back reflector, pretty large, so you're going to be seen if someone has headlights. Uh, just of course, we always recommend a lighting system if you're going to ride at night to keep yourself safe. So the next option is uh, the battery light set. So you've got your front flashlight. Again, you see the flashing mode there, and also a steady mode. Um, when you're going to fold the bike, you want to turn this up and then also you can just take it right off, use it as a flashlight, kind of help you see around at night. And then the rear light right here, all you do is click it on and off. It's a steady light and it also has these reflectors on the side, so that's going to be great. You'll be able to be seen. So hub dynamos are great because it's a system that's all contained within the bike and you never have to buy batteries, you kind of have this power source that's always readily available to you. Now the Shimano Dynamo is a great cost-effective way to get that excellent system. So you see here, this is the Dynamo, it's actually a little generator right inside the wheel there. Um, so anytime you spin the wheel, anytime you start to move, this halogen bulb will light up. So for example, if I just spin the wheel, you see it light up nicely there. There's also a reflector ring around the front to give you a little extra brightness. In the back, the same way that I spin the front wheel and it lights up, there. And this actually has a little bit of a stand light feature, you're getting a bit now. It's usually much brighter. It actually stays like a battery kind of charged up there for several minutes after you've stopped riding. And that's a good safety feature because, you know, for a system that only lights up when you're riding, what if you come to a stoplight? So here we've got the super efficient uh, San Hub Dynamo. Now this is really the top of the line of any hub dynamo that you could get for any bicycle. And so with the Brompton, this is just uh, the San Dynamo right here in the wheel. You've got a highly efficient, high power headlight here. So let me just spin this and give you an idea what this looks like. So very bright there. And it's also got this reflective layer around the front. Now one great feature about the San above the Shimano is that you've got a front stand light. So I'm not even spinning this anymore, clearly, but the light remains lit. So that's a really excellent safety feature. Anytime you come to a stoplight, that's, uh, that's nice to still have that light in the front. Coming back to the rear, you see also we've already got our rear stand light has engaged, um, charged up by the same dynamo in the front. I'll uh, give it a spin again so you can see. So one of the best things about the San Dynamo, I mean aside from its gorgeous looks, is that it's highly efficient. You get much less drag than with the Shimano. It's also more lightweight, so it doesn't, it doesn't impact your like, carrying so much. So it still remains nice and portable. And um, yeah, this is really a deluxe 
feature for your bike. So if you're already building a totally deluxe bike, I mean, you might as well add in that Son Dynamo because it's really, really awesome to have.